So what's up everybody, Frank will hear you, welcome to the channel, how you doing, I hope you're doing absolutely fantastic today, I wish you that much every single day, I know I frown, that's my rest beach face, beach resting face, can't help it, alright, it's the aging process, the sun tanning, the white hair, we have to cope with it, alright, I just looked at myself in the mirror, so give me a second to adjust, to that awareness of decay. Anyway, we have to talk about something else that is decaying, which is the career of AH. Decaying already for several months, and there is no hand in sight of recouping that. Anyway, another career that is skyrocketing is actually Johnny Depp's career, which is doing absolutely great. So much so that uh, I kind of, uh, I envy him in an absolutely positive way. I would love to tour with Jeff Beck too. I mean, because there is new tour coming out. I would love to make more music like he's doing as well. Anyway, so uh, here we have this article that is coming out after all the other new videos that we have reacted yesterday about the boat dancing and the Bieber song. I was actually thinking about that Bieber song and um, I came to a realization, which is, I don't know if that song is connected directly to Johnny Depp, but it's definitely connected to an inside joke connected with these people to an event. So they see those people singing the same song in different places, different times. So it really suggests that it's something that they, um, you know, between them, of course, know what is related to, which could be getting the money from JD, maybe even getting a settlement from Elon Musk, you know, after uh, perhaps the embryo debacle, which is also something that it's possible, you know. Uh, we know through Jennifer Owl that uh, uh, Elon Musk wanted to sue AH for those remaining embryos that he wanted to destroy it. So maybe something also went on, and I'm totally speculating on this. But it just came to mind, you know, like just came to mind. I was like, wow, this woman probably, you know, she uses this song as to probably kind of celebrate, you know, like, sorry, not sorry that uh, we won also this case and we got this money out of you, which could be either JD or Elon Musk for whatever reason. Let me know your thoughts on that. Anyway, here we have a source. Amber Heard has reportedly been relying on the continued support of her sister, Whitney, when it comes to handling Johnny Depp continued success in the media after the defamation case, this revelation has been brought to light by an inside source close to Hollywood life. Inside source? We have no idea. Probably Barlow Lady, I suppose. I don't know. According to the source, Whitney has been a pillar of strength for Amber throughout this whole ordeal and she doesn't know what she would do without her by their side, her side especially since Amber knows it was a lot to deal with and she couldn't have done it without her. This sounds like somebody has written this script for them. And also lies, lies, many lies. So honestly, I don't know what to make of this. You know, if there is somebody that is responsible for destroying their career, she's basically her. She's literally the only person responsible for destroying her life. This person had everything going for her. Literally married one of the biggest stars in Hollywood with the biggest connection in the world of acting. And instead, she just tried to destroy the man. And in the pro process, actually, the truth came out and she destroyed herself, apparently. Right? So... Another thing that I find very fascinating here is uh, recently we've talked about this. Jason Momoa gave an interview on Aquaman 2 and uh, he was asked about this lady actually thumbs up because he, she managed to squeeze in the question asking about uh, Amber H. And Jason Momoa totally deflect the thing like they say here, uh, like Neo in the bullet uh, scene. Honestly, very good. But also, I don't blame Jason Momoa to try to deflect that. But he did it like a champ. All the hype, all the buzz, all the talk. Aquaman 2 
What can we expect? Have you talked to Amber? How are things? It's just laughs. Me and Patrick, it's, it's, a, it's a bit of a brother's journey. Woo! Yeah! Wow! that back. Woo! So nice to see my, my fellow castmates. Um, sorry, she threw me off. Um, and, uh, Actually, I haven't seen this part where he takes this long pose and basically not only deflects, but he actually tries to avoid the question by reacting to the fellow cast member. I mean, you can really tell in his voice the guy didn't appreciate the question in the way that, oh boy, I don't want to go there right now. That's exactly how it felt. Um, yeah, it's just a lot of laughs and also a lot of pain. So just wonderful action for the next level. <laughs> All right, this is just extra stuff. We don't care. Artist. But I, I find it absolutely funny the way he reacted to her like, sorry, I managed to deflect this. Would have been interesting to, to, to see the journalist uh, kind of pressuring on a little bit more and ask another question. But then again, you know, the, the guy can just refuse. And also you over, how do you say, like uh, you overstay your welcome, so to speak. So the journalist tried her best. We will see. But you can have a sense that um, they don't want to talk about her. They don't want to talk about her because honestly, is a First Amendment attorney, is that? Honestly, they don't want to talk about her because this franchise, uh, it's already like not looking good. So whether or not she's going to be in, some of the image of that franchise is being stained. And uh, I think Warner Brothers knows this and somehow will try, I will continue to try to do, to do damage control because there is too many people out there, hundreds of millions probably, uh, around the world, which will boycott the movie for sure, because overweight, you know, when it comes out on DVD. So Warner Brothers knows this, and they will try to do everything in their power to minimize the presence of, of the problem, you know, both in the movie, in the press conferences, and all around it. So anyway, guys, just a little short video today. There is not so much no new things. Go check the videos of yesterday as well. I did also a video of Marilyn Manson. Um, go support that as well so that we can go deeper on that video as well, and that reality and that trial. And I keep suggesting I'm right here. Please subscribe in mass. Boom, 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 boom. The more the better, as always. You make this happen every single day. Now it's time to drink some water also for me. Ciao. Take care. Wow.